We'll guide you through how to fix an external hard drive not showing up in Windows 11 and 10 on a PC or laptop. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This can be super annoying as it means you can't go and use it and you can't go and see it in File Explorer. So first of all, go and look at the hard drive. If it's usually got an LED light on it, make sure that is flashing. If it isn't, try changing out the cable which connects your computer to it. And you can also try using a different USB port as well. Hopefully that goes and solves the problem. After you've done that, open up File Explorer and go and see if it's now appearing. If it still isn't, don't worry. Come down to the bottom and click on search. And you want to go and type in disk partitions like so. And this goes and opens up something called disk management. Come down to the second half here and scroll down. And what you need to do is go and find the drive. You can go and see the size to the left, which will help identify it. And you also want to go and look in this middle part here. So it's important to note different things may be happening here. For example, in this case, this drive does not have a letter. This means it won't go and show up in File Explorer. However, the space also may not be allocated as well. I'll cover that in a moment. So if it's got the space allocated, but there's no drive letter, you'll see to the right of new volume, there's not one here, but there is one here. Right click on it and click on change drive letter and paths. Tap on add and you can then go and choose the letter. So we can go and choose E, that's fine. And now when we come back to File Explorer, I can click out of it and back to it and you'll see it's now appearing. Alternatively, you may notice the space is unallocated. If that's the case, go and right click on it, tap on new simple volume and we can go and allocate the space. Press next and next again. You can then choose a drive letter, press next. Adjust the settings, you don't have to though. Press next and press finish. The space will now be allocated and it will go and appear in your File Explorer. As you can see here it is, you may need to click off to a different folder and come back and it should then go and appear. Now, if you come to it and it's showing up here but it's not showing up in your file explorer, it may be somehow corrupted or something like that. So if there's no important files on it or nothing on it at all, then what we can do is go and reformat it. You can go and right click on it, click on format, and we can then go and press OK. You can adjust the settings here. Once again, I don't tend to. We can press yes and it'll go and reformat it. And that should hopefully go and fix the problem. Return to File Explorer. You can click off it and then come back to this PC and hopefully then it'll go and appear. I hope you found this useful and it resolved your problem.